space on those four missions. We're about uh, 25 minutes or so away from the uh, time that uh, the three departing crew members members uh, will be gathering uh, right there at the hatchway of Soyuz just a few minutes from now. Thank you. And Laurel O'Hara the returning NASA crew member about to say goodbye to the rest of her crewmates And there's uh, the Soyuz MS-24, a brief glimpse as the uh, crew members continue to gather in the passageway. There's Marina Vasilevskaya. And Soyuz Commander Oleg Novitsky. As we uh, prepare to uh, see the three returning crew members enter the Soyuz, uh, the report back from the Russian Mission Control Center in Koryov is that Soyuz has been transitioned to autonomous power. And there's Laurel O'Hara. Expedition 21, and also, of course, expedition on, of ISS. Also, our greetings to you as well, and congratulations. And with that, a final uh, wave from Vasilevskaya and O'Hara, and now Novitsky on board the Soyuz, having bid farewell to their expedition colleagues. Novitsky and Vasilevskaya returning to Earth after two weeks on the station, O'Hara wrapping up 204 days aboard the orbital outpost. As Kononenko wipes down uh, the hatchway interface before the uh, hatches will swing closed. The International Space Station currently flying 260 miles over Osaka, Japan. The hatch closed on the Rosviad module side. It will be standing by for confirmation of the Soyuz hatch closure.
So hatches on both sides of the uh, docking interface between Rosvia and uh, the Soyuz MS-24 that you see in, in, in your view. Both of those hatches are closed right on time. As uh, the crew now on the Soyuz side, as well as uh, the station crew, will begin a series of leak checks at the uh, docking interface to make sure we have a tight seal before the uh, passageway or small vestibule between uh, the two spacecraft is depressurized in preparation for undocking. Copy. Undocking confirmed. Right on time at 10.54 p.m. Central Time, 11.54 p.m. Eastern Time. Soyuz MS-24 has broken free from its mooring at the International Space Station. Expedition 70 is complete. Expedition 71 now underway.